Welcome back to the vlog guys. Good morning. It is about 5.45 in the a.m. Sunday morning. Uh, about to head out to the meat spot for my caravan that uh, that I'm doing to go down to San Diego. Um, hopefully I get some dope rollers of whoever shows up today in the morning and then uh, catch up with you guys again when we get to San Diego and uh, start showing you the cars. So uh, hopefully today uh, it's a good day. It's supposed to be really nice out there. I think it's like 74 down there in San Diego. So today's gonna be a good day. Everybody, we are here at the old school versus new school meet down in San Diego at Ski Beach Park. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and do a walk around. It's still early. There should be a lot more people that are gonna show up. There's a lot of people already here, but there should be a lot more people showing up um, as the day progresses. So I'm gonna go ahead and film as much as I can for now, and then I'll do another walk around later and. I don't know what I'll do. I don't know if I'm going to do cinematics for all the cars or if I'm going to do um, just me basically walking around. Uh, I'll figure it out in post and see what happens. But I hope you guys enjoy the cars. I'll get as much interior and exterior shots as I can. But uh, yeah, let's do it guys. I see lots of dope super clean Hondas all day today should be pretty dope so if you're not familiar which I'm, I'm assuming most of you aren't uh, 
the SoCal CRV guys. This is Fabes. Uh, I think it's EF underscore Fabes. Uh, I'll, I'll post his uh, Instagram tag below and then I'll also put it in the video. Uh, this is uh, CRV Godoy and his B20 uh, VTEC Turbo CRV. He's off road. And then my V with the new Ambers looking oh so good. This is TLHV. You guys seen him in the last video, at least that you've seen the CRV in the last video. This is the Passionate Breed's other car, his other uh, Honda. So I will try and get uh, interior shots for you guys when windows are open. Clean, I want to say it's a 64, 63 Impala. And I used to have one of these. I had a 2000 SI Electric Blue Pearl. By far my favorite Honda I've ever owned. And the cleanest Honda I ever owned. Super clean. And then we got this sick little EG. Uh, it's actually EG1. Flex fuel, look at that. Oh, okay, yeah, it is a 64. Uh, I want to say these guys right here are from Corona, Riverside area. Smells like broccoli around here, bro. coming to these meets because you get to see such clean Hondas like most people associate Hondas as being junky and trash but no bro the detail that goes into these Hondas for I'd say 99% of the enthusiasts out there is just impeccable I'm showing you guys around but there's so much to look at My boys, R31, Skyline. He had to he had to come show face. Huh? The intake tube coming out of the headlight. <laughs> it is right. <laughs> cost almost as much as my car. <laughs>
Integra after clean Integra. I mean, your definition of clean and my definition of clean, probably two different things. But I think little dents here and there that, that just build character, bro. I mean, I consider my car clean and, and she's got dings and, and flaws galore, but if you love your car and you, you keep it clean, then I consider it clean. This just caught my eye. Clean little V with the uh, JDM wing and mirror. Super, super clean. You gotta love a CRV. Whether whether you drive one or you don't, these things are dope. little CVCC bro that thing is sick. see so all the patina and all the little dings and dents that he's fixing and stuff that gives it character bro and it looks pissed off <laughs> The wing? Yeah. Uh, I haven't heard from my boy Gus yet. Automotive Anatomy. Where you at, bro? With that Mugen grill? This thing. With that Type R front end. Or it could even be an RR front end. Uh, I'm not 100% positive on that. I, it's either Type R or RR. One of the two. Super clean though. I think Del Sol's are very underappreciated. You don't see them all that often and when you do, they're gems bro, gems. Going, bro? Good. Um, this is the dude that was at the meetup for the caravan this morning. He came down with us. You don't see a TSX wagon, especially one this fucking clean, bro. The stance is so nice on this thing. Dang it. so in 2017 when these things got released I thought that they're gonna be rare sites but you actually see, at least here in Cali you see these things everywhere everybody has one and it's always blue and I'll prove that point right now <laughs> oh look at this EF bro how clean is that Damn. Everything is super clean. Sorry, the reflection is pretty bad, so you guys can't really see in there, but it's clean. It's got the JDM interior and everything. Wow. I'm going to have to come back and take a picture, a couple pictures of this guy. Alright, so remember I said there's a lot of Type R's, especially blue? So that was the first one you just seen. So it's two. It's three. That's four. And there's a, there's a, a fifth one over there. These two are SIs. Actually, no, the black one is a Type R also.
Actually, no, that's a Type R, too. It's Type R, too. Yeah, they're all... Type R's are everywhere, bro. Look, there's a white one right there. This is another one of the dudes that came with us on the caravan. This used to be Christian's car from G Development. Super clean, bro. Another Type R with a sick little livery on it. I like that. Just trying to do something to stand out from the rest of the Type R's. Because, like I said, there's there's a lot here in Cali now. So I like that. I like how he was trying to um, be a little different. Look at this thing, bro. This thing is sick. So I will show you guys the interior on this thing. So I want to say those are Honda seats. 100%. <laughs> the S2000 fucking cluster that's lit. Clean, 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 clean. Simple and clean. That's what I like. Is that SI? You actually see less SIs than you do Type R's here in Cali. Which is nuts, because you figure it'd be the other way around. But no, you see way more Type R's show up at shows than SIs do. And in my opinion, look at look at that thing. I mean, SIs are sick. Type R row right there. Type R row. The Instagram tag, EF boys. That's super clean, bro. Team Ultra Speed. I like it. I like the name. It's got the for real bumpers. I like it. Well, that's something you don't see every day. Especially at meets, you don't you don't ever see. Super clean. I mean, Moyes. Moise is the exception though. Moise freaking Accord is super freaking clean. He's the only other, uh, I don't know what chassis code this is, but he's the only other Accord in this generation that I know of that's this clean. Got a ruckus out here. Okay, Stan Turbo C5. An Infinity and another super clean EF. The Gen Correct wheels are fucking legit. Let's see if we can see a little better. Yeah, we can see a little better with it. It's got the JD interior and everything. Yeah. Ah, no, never mind. That steering wheel is fucking old school too. I used to have one of these when I was going through UTI back uh, back when I was like 18. I had one of these. I beat the crap out of it. <laughs> They're fun cars though. I called out to get there and he had gotten there before me and took the front seat. Super clean Toyota pickup. I'm actually thinking of picking one of these up just to be like a go fast car or truck. Hmm.
So I don't care if your your car is paint chipping, that kind of thing. If you have pride in your car, bro, fucking show it. That's the best when you when you see people that show their hard work. I like it. It's got tons of character. And this is Instagram tag. Platinum Motor Works. Super clean Civic, bro. I like it a lot. B20. I like it. Tegra. <laughs> oh, look at this thing. You got a clean EG hatch. You got a turbo EG hatch. How do you know it's turbo? Oh, I don't know. Maybe a giant fucking intercooler? <laughs> That's clean. That's a color you don't see very often. Damn, look at that. I've never seen those Recaros in that color. I wonder if he got it reupholstered like that. Most likely? I've never seen those that color. That's lit. Super, super clean. Joker Civic, that's fucking sick. Why so serious? Another super clean EF. These things are getting a little more popular again, which is always dope. You gotta appreciate the classics. You gotta know where you came from to know where you're going, bro. And this is definitely where us as Honda guys came from. And you gotta appreciate it. Super clean bride steering wheel. Or, or Nardi, I'm sorry. Lady driven, that's always dope. Now we're getting down towards the end. I will continue filming the last few cars that are here. I'll show you guys here on this thing. Super clean, the energy seats. Sparkle steering wheel. I like it. It's clean. size I've I want to say I've seen this the CRX around I'm not 100% sure where but that color just looks on it with the, the body kit and everything just looks familiar I'm not exactly sure where I've seen it but I've, it looks familiar You got the last two little e EK hatches. Clean and simple. Looks like it still has AC. Some interior action, because I know you guys like the, the, the interior shots. Simple and clean. Race car, bro. Look at that, that's, that's legit. I'd be scared to suck stuff in that, but that's sick. <laughs> Keep it so lame. No, I gotta do some cleaning and I'm kinda 
Super clean. Actually, the first S2000 that showed up today, which is really weird because you see S2000s at all the meets and they're everywhere, but. <laughs> guys like that. Don't be that guy. Get you some shots of the inside of this thing. Super clean buddy club, Ram Drive. Legit. Not a fan of the wink mirror. This dude has a wink mirror. I just don't like how it eliminates your, your visors and all that stuff. Like, four door integrity, you don't see these very often. You see two doors all day long, but four doors you don't see very often. Especially ones that are this clean. This one's pretty fucking clean. Those C28s? Ooh boy. There's actually more NSXs today than there are S2000s. That's very uncommon. Ooh, the bronze TE37s. Look at that. Ooh by far my favorite wheel of all time. Super clean Recaros. You know, with the factory leather interior. Super nice. Look at this. It's after a, modeled after a Blue Angel Jet. That's legit. Super clean and simple. Here's the Instagram tag. Blue Batmobile. That's blue. Sick little truck. He's got the bottle caps, the BMW bottle caps. Super clean. Uh, hatchy. Oh boy. Sorry about that. 
Yeah. Good, how are you? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. I'll show you guys the interior of this thing. Six got the Gretty steering wheel. I actually was gonna get this steering wheel before I got my Momo. I really like that wheel. Automotive Anatomy, where are you, bro? I guess could make it out today, but I'll make sure to get him some Accord content. Look at that. Bronze. Are those seeds? No, they're works. Those are clean. I thought they were CE28s, but no, they're works. Clean Lexus. Okay, clean and simple, just how I like it. You got this guy. Back in the day, I'd say about 10 years ago, I had a uh, 91 hatch just like this in white and it was uh, case swapped. I would have been the first or one of the first EF hatches that was case swapped, but at the time I was working a part-time job so I couldn't afford to finish it so I had to sell it, which sucks, but uh, at least I can say I tried. It was probably about 75% complete and I just couldn't afford the, the K-Pro and I couldn't afford the, the harness. So I had to sell it. Clean, clean, clean. Oh, super, look at that. Super clean TSX. It's got a bunch of Mugen goodies on it. That's a lit. Like oh, another Type R. There's actually three more Type R's. Black one. Some Advans. And there's two more. Ooh, this one's got the CDs on it. 